Hi guys, it's Lita. So I am doing some Christmas decor shopping or like Gothmas or Creepmas or whatever us spooky people feel like we want to call it to make it less Christmassy. <laughs> Yeah, so I reason the reason I like decided to do this was because I saw on someone's video that Kirkland's has a black stick tree and I don't want to put my full tree up this year because we have a new dog and she's a maniac and I think that I won't be home enough to watch the tree to guard it safely because you have to keep an eye on her 24-7 and I just don't want the tree to get wrecked because I like my Christmas tree. Um, so I was going to buy the little Christmas tree from Kirkland's to just have a tree to put up, but my Kirkland's didn't have it. They're still putting stuff out, so it's possible that like they will get that tree, but they don't have it now. But I did start filming in Kirkland's because Kirkland's had a lot of really cute black Christmas festive decor like that I would be okay there's always there's always people driving by when I start talking um that I would be okay putting up that wouldn't be like crazy like red like I'm actually pretty lazy when it comes to Christmas decorating I just slap a bunch of Santa hats on the skulls and spooky shit in my house and then like put an advent calendar banner up and that's pretty much it um I do the lights outside my house but I don't know if I'm going to be doing that year this this year either so but I decided to see if Kirkland's had this tree they don't but they had a lot of cute stuff so I filmed that I am going to go to Michael's real quick and if they still have the uh, last bit of Halloween tree ornaments I am gonna grab those for possibly the a mini tree that I get um, because they're super cheap now and then I might go to TJ Maxx I don't know if I'm gonna like if I see something that I like at TJ Maxx I don't know if I'm gonna buy it because honestly like my TJ Maxx is ridiculous now the line goes all the way around the store the last time I went in there to buy like Halloween stuff off like after Halloween like clearanced so yeah but we're gonna go to Michael's and see if they have any ornaments left but yeah um I guess I will talk about what I saw at TJ Maxx or at Kirkland's Kirkland's it's Kirkland's at Kirkland's um, when I get over there because I can't drive and talk at the same time because people are holiday driving. That's the day before Thanksgiving. So this was well planned. <laughs> okay, so Kirkland's had a lot of black items. Like I said, uh, I was looking for the tree, the stick tree, the black stick tree that they didn't have. Uh, but they had a lot of black wall art. They had like a snowflake print, two snowflake prints, a piece on earth, wall art with holly on it. That wasn't too bad. Um, some black reindeer, some black jingle bells, which I considered getting lots of black like garland stuff which is cool and uh black and white tree skirt like plaid tree skirt so like that's really nice to see because it's not just like red or green or red and green or like silver which isn't bad so i'll take silver too but um it's nice that there's a lot of like black stuff out there that you can like mix in with your own spooky stuff that's not like freaking like I said red or green or red and green or like 
fucking like Santas or like angels or you know what I mean? Like it's very like minimalistic Christmas, which I'm here for. I like that. So I'm at TJ Maxx. We're gonna like blast through this really quickly. It doesn't look that busy, but I also have to get home and start prepping for Thanksgiving. So, but I do want to see what's out there because I've been watching people's videos and like I'm intrigued of like some of the Christmas stuff that's out there, which is uh, new for me because usually after Halloween, like it's pretty much downhill for me. So, we're going to go to TJ Maxx, and then we are going to go into Michael's, which is in the same shopping center, so. So, we're back at the house, because uh, I just, like, really needed to be done being out. Like, it's just insane out there now. It's just crazy. Uh, I had to go to Publix, because we didn't have any milk when I got back home, so, like... I need milk to make stuff tomorrow, so yeah, um, worst day to go to any grocery store. Anyways, we went to TJ Maxx, there were some black reindeer that I liked at TJ Maxx. Uh, there is a blanket that if it had been different colors would have been pretty cute. It had like Christmas trees and moons. But it was pastel. If it had been like black, it would have been so good because it had moons, Christmas trees, stars. And then, I don't know, uh, a lot of silver stuff, like a lot of silver reindeer. Uh, I almost bought a pot for one of the plants that I got at Michael's, but then like the line, like I said, where's my timer? The line was down the aisles of the store, which is like ridiculous. I'm not spending that much time in TJ Maxx ever, like waiting in line now. Uh, so I didn't get that. And like, I just don't, I don't know. My TJ Maxx is kind of a mess anyways. So there wasn't anything really that I saw like Christmas wise that I was like, wow. Oh, except for, I take that back. There's this wooden tree that was kind of like a crescent moon shaped also and then it had a little bell in it and that was super cute I really really liked that uh I think that was my favorite thing that I saw in TJ Maxx and then Michaels I didn't film too much in Michaels like I don't know I don't really care for anything that Michaels puts out for like Christmas this year it's pretty like traditional Christmas if you ask me and uh, they did have some Halloween out, so I will do a jiggy hell after Halloween haul because I bought a mini Christmas tree because they had one left. So I bought it, so that's going to be my tree this year. Okay, so from Michael's, what I got was I got one of these Gothic Garden brooms. Just a plain one. I guess you're supposed to like decorate it or something. I don't know. Then I got this other broom from Ashland. It says Enchanted Forest Mini Broom. But somebody tore all the... I think they tore, like, all of the hanging stuff off. Do you see what I mean? Or somebody tore something off. Something's definitely missing. Maybe it's moss or whatever. I don't know. Then I got the last of these ornaments. They just have witches on them. They had ones like this that had haunted houses. I should have grabbed those when I saw them, but I didn't, and they're gone now. All they have is ones that say trick or treat on them, and I'm not doing that. And I got some lights for the mini tree. Two boxes of those. I hope they're actually purple and not red. If you can see my table, like, the, ha the house is a mess. We just got a turkey fryer, so, like, it's exploded all over that dining room table. Then I got a bat banner. And then... 
got this black and purple mini tree. I don't even know how these much these were originally. How much were you? So these were like $20 and I got it for like $5 and it's going to be my Christmas tree for this year. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed decor hunting with me, Christmas decor hunting with me. Didn't buy anything Christmas related at all. So yeah, let me know what you guys are doing as far as your Christmas decorations this year. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Follow me on other social media. My must be posted in the description box down below. Hit that notification bell so you guys know when I upload. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.